What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Unreal sent them here, and... Yep, today we are going to be doing episode 5. It's going to be another episode with HyperX Fusion. How amazing is that? So, unfortunately, guys, unfortunately, we already did this episode, but it didn't turn out so well. The start to the episode was insanely laggy. That's why we're having to do the intro all over again. And that's why we've got this sick armor, because me and Hyper found some amazing armor. Hyper looking like Thor from the Avengers, and me looking like an insane beast with my armor. We found a lot of good armor in this episode. So stay tuned for episode 5. Alright guys, so it just turned morning. Um, we got the items for basically crafting stuff. Now it turns out all of these items require a lot of cementing paste and stone and metal. Primarily metal. So if we're going to be building a massive castle, we're going to need a good Ancleo and Dodecarus. So do you think we should have a look for... Let's see, we can't get... I wonder if there's an Alpha Anclio, because we can't get anything fabled. Can we try and get an Alpha Ankleosaurus, Hyper? Yeah. Alright, I'm going to craft about 10 of the Alpha Kills. And we'll go looking for one, yeah? Fingers crossed we can get a male and a female, that way we can get a load of metal. And then we'll go looking for a Dodec. Sound like a plan? Sounds like a plan. Where's the crystal around here then? Alright guys, me and Hyper are at the desert. Hyper's around here somewhere. I see yeah, obsidian. I see obsidian here, so I'm gonna get this. Oh wow, you actually are right behind me. I didn't know where you went. Anyway, so there, there should be metal around here as well. Fingers crossed. And we are looking for an Ancleo and a Dodecarus, but we're also looking for metal and obsidian while we're here. Invisible Rock Drake! Got it. Be careful, Blake. They don't go after you. They go after the diner. All right, yeah. Um, <laughs> I called you Blake. <laughs> Sorry. All right, guys. We're going to just chill here. Take down some stuff, chill for a bit, and I'll meet you guys back when we're ready to tame an Ancleo and a Dodecarus. I'm sure we'll find one. We're looking for an Alpha one, if anything. Oh, God. All right, guys, you're not going to believe this, but Hyper's actually found an Alpha Dodecarus. So let's teleport to him and then see if we can actually tame this thing. Nice try, buddy. Nice try, buddy. Nice try, buddy. Oh, nice try, buddy. Nice try, buddy. Oh no, 11 alpha kibble? Oh, okay. Guys, this is going to be hard. I've only got 10. I'm going to have to go back to base to get more. This is insane. This thing requires that ton. Yeah, it's worth it though. I'll be right back once I've got the resources for this guy. Where did he go? No, he's there. Not until tamed. Look okay, I'm looking after your pterodon. Okay, let's get more kibble then. Uh. Alpha Kibble, can we get like 10 more? <laughs> yes, we can. Can we get even more? I've got enough for one more. All right, well, we can get 11. That should be enough. Here we go, Kibble. Throw it in, get a Tame Helper, because that is not gonna be... Yeah, we are gonna need one. Because it's food. It's gonna be eaten a lot. Man, just hear it, crunch. Have you got enough for the female? I am currently making 10 more alpha kibbles. Yeah, okay, we've got him. Send me back to base. Let's head back to base. I'm moving by the female. Wait, no, you've got my uh, dino on your shoulder. There you go. This is going to be another oh, weird one. one oh, yeah, sure, Can I hit you? Because I'm staying Why? by its head. <laughs> I'm staying by its head. No I'm not way. going near that tail. You're mental. Oh my god. Oh, I hit it after it was down. It's going to lose some levels. Oh well, we can tame them for levels. Yeah, good idea. Alright. I know, I've never been this far away from home. Alright, here we go. Kibble. 
taming potion. Do we need it? You know what, we got so many, we might as well make it faster. Damn it. Are we back? Alright, at least we got a male and a female Dodecarus. That is insane. An alpha Dodecarus, male and female. I'm so happy with that. Ah. Absolutely insane. Let's see if we can find an alpha Ankylosaurus and then I'll meet you guys back. Absolutely insane. These Pteranodons have such a high weight capacity. I mean, I could barely move, but this this tyrannomon has got how much metal in it, and yet it's still able to move perfectly. It's insane. Sorry, sorry, didn't mean to hit you. Hey guys, welcome back to base. So, they're currently breeding. There's currently three minutes less in her... Kind of, what's it called? It's called gestation, but really it's labour. So, basically, Hyper's base got destroyed. And this is what was left. I wish I was not happy about. Yeah, it was not cool. His base got destroyed by an Omega Wyvern. You've how. got a lot of resources in here, you know. Yeah, I know. I just took my need to move this. So oh, okay. Yeah, he's going to have to rely on a thatch door for now. Uh, it was pretty insane. Yeah, it was pretty insane. So, luckily, my Alpha Pteranodon survived because he got trapped on a mountain and Hyper saved me. When he saved me, we got back to base and these two, we couldn't find their soul orbs anywhere. I thought they were done for, to be honest. Look at all the fertilized eggs. Yeah, we should probably stop these from breeding now, right? Behavior, disable mating, behavior. Hyper's currently trying to fix his base. I feel so bad for him. Do you need any resources? You know you can well, pull it from my base, happen. right? Know, you knew it was going to happen. Yeah. Well, we got the Alpha Dodex saddles. So at least the that. I say, uh, should we breed these a couple of times? Who knows? She might have twins. It's very common. Oh, yeah. Hyper's got some amazing things. He's got two alpha... Are they alpha or normal? Uh, okay, he's got normal rock drake eggs. Oh, wow. What level are you? 557. A baby alpha dotec. That's so cool. It looks so much like its mother. That is insane. We should probably give it some berries, right? Yeah, let's give it some mejos. Ew, dude. It's female as well. They're alphas. They're going to lay eggs. That's amazing. I need some food. I know i got some cooked food in me somewhere. So, should we go looking for the... Alpha, what is it? The Alpha Ankylos, and then yeah. start building the castle. All right, guys, sounds like a plan. I'll meet you guys back when we're building the castles and we've got the Alpha Dodex. So this is kind of a weird episode. We're doing a lot of stuff without you guys, which is kind of crazy, but at the same time, it's kind of needed because if we're going to be building a giant castle in one episode, then we're gonna need the dinos for it, and at the same time, we're gonna have to cut quite a lot out. So. You'll see us tame, but there's probably going to be a lot less footage for that in this episode. But these, absolutely amazing. And now means that they're not breeding. We can actually check <coughs> them out. So let's go and sort this one out. I want to see how much these can get. Wow, we just got 2,000 stone from that. Oh, that's insane. Oh, we're never going to have to worry about stone again. Oh, yeah, this is brilliant. I'm loving this. And the weight capacity they have. Look at this. That's insane. Oh, I love that little level up dance. It's like, oh, yeah, I got a level up. Oh, that is sick. 
Oh, we're getting so much stone. This is amazing. This is truly amazing. Can it get wood as well? It can get more facts than wood, but okay. It got like a hundred wood there. I'll, I'll rate that. Oh, that is cool. Yeah, so I'll meet you guys back when we're either taming the Angios or when we're building the castle. Guys, you're not going to believe this. So, I was just doing my own thing, making kibble. We got about 18 alpha kibble, right? And then Hyper comes along and says, Yeah, I found uh, I found uh, a male Anclio. Because we were looking for the male first. And, it, and he's like, oh, brilliant. An alpha male Anclio. And then I'm like, oh, brilliant. We'll just have to go ahead and get that then. And he's like, yeah, yeah, I found two of them. And I'm like, wait, what? Two How the hell does he actually find this stuff? It's insane. First off, he found two alpha dodecaruses straight away without any help. Now he's found not one, but two. Obviously, they're both male, so we still have to look for a female. But Hyper, how? I don't know. I don't know why I'm so good this time. Could we use a gender potion, I wonder? Is there a gender potion oh, that would in be this? Good. Oh, gender elixir requires guardian elements. Yeah, but do we have guardian element? I, I think that requires one of every piece of. Yeah, that's guy mana element, not guardian element. That would require one of every piece of. Uh, we'd need to destroy one of every guardian in order to get that. So no, we'd have to get a female. But which one's the better one to get? What's attacking us? Uh, the alpha. The alpha down there. Yeah. I'd say get the red one. Yeah, I'd say. What's the highest level actually? The highest level is 380. the 380. Get the 380 one, I think. Yeah, I'll get the 380. Uh oh. Uh, buddy, little help here. Um, I suppose I could just old score it. Yeah. Dizzy old score. The old fashioned find a dino you want and shove a pike inside him. Here we go, guys. We got this. Come on. Yep. Probably gonna get killed. But he's very low on Torpor. Got it. But the other one's gonna be after me now. Oh god, if it hits it, then it's going to lose tame effectiveness. Did you hit this? No, I drew the... Uh, okay. Oh. So it was 8. And then we get the tame helper. We use an X50 for now, guys. Here we go. Got it knocked out. I killed you, one. Nice. Oh, it's got beautiful love of old colours as well. I might have been on an accident. Yeah, the time and effectiveness is actually 48 to 45 percent instead of 100. It lost quite a few levels. Don't worry about it. All right, guys. So we've got another one, a female. We already got it knocked out. We were just waiting for the kibble, and now we crafted it up. We should have 12 pieces of kibble. Nope, I actually got the kibble and forgot to pick up the kibble I crafted. Wow. What an idiot. Alright, so we are heading back to Tame. Oh Mason. my god. What is it, Hyper? Look. Okay. I'm not seeing anything. Wait, did you build another base? Yeah, but look at this thing. Whoa. This place is huge. Oh yeah, defo. I'm seeing that. See, it comes in help as well. Wait, it's got an inbuilt greenhouse. You see what I mean? It comes in help. We've got our breeding centre now. Wow. Oh, that is amazing. I'm loving it. Hyper built us a breeding centre. Oh, I love that. 
That is insane, guys. Should I put it in more? Castle, yeah, I'd, I'd, I'd move it can to a more flat area. Can you, can you move it in a better place? No, I can't be bothered. We need to get the dino first. Can you do it, Hyper? I can't do it. Oh, fine, I'll do it. Hyper always makes me move the stuff. We did that with his old base, too. To be fair, though, I'm helping you. It's a breeding centre. To be fair, you did build us a breeding And I center. saved your diner. Yeah, mine diner. Yes, okay. Oh, okay, that's fair enough. Alright, here we go. We got our Tame Helper X50. We might actually need a, another Tame Helper. I just thought if, it, if that's that big, I wonder what the last building is going to be. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That's going to be easy. Yeah, you, you're going to use a lot of our metal, man. There's just one metal. Well, yeah, it is. We can get more metal anyway. We've got yeah, the that's true. We do have the Anclios now for metal, so we we'll don't get. We really have to worry that much. Yeah. I say we head back to base. This is insane. We finally got an Anclio we can use. Oh, yeah, well, I am picking that up. A male and a female. Should we get these bred immediately? Yeah. I want to start unhatching the uh, rock drake. Unhatching? Well... Hatching. You want to put the baby uh, back in the egg? They're hatching on me. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to meet you guys back in a bit once we've bred these Ancleos. And then we'll get the castle done. Hey guys, look at what I just got. A pick, a axe and a saddle. All from killing the Guardian. That's amazing. There's so much loot here that I've got by killing stuff. We got bags over here as well, like primal stimulants and stuff from bullets. It's insane. Uh, it, I know there's another bag around here as well that I want to get. With the metal pick I've got now, I get around about 500 wood. What do we get with this? 1,506 wood. What the? Does that mean the pig's going to be insane? That is insanity. Okay, so normally with the pick, I'm getting around about 400 of the flint. 200. Okay, and with my other pick, is it the same? A hundred. So, that picks better? That's insane. I wonder how much it'll get with metal. Oh, we need to find metal and test this out. Alright, guys. I don't know if Hyper's coming with us, but I want to get a Gaia Snail. So, there's one relatively close to base here, actually. Because uh, that's where we are, and then there's a snail right there. A 340 female. If we can find a male as well, then we can have breedable Gaia snails. So, uh, that's Hyper's Pteranodon. Where's my one? I know I've got my one on record, so if I just teleport him across here. There we go. Then we can go find this snail. It is not within 500 meters at all. That's so long away. Alright, well, I'll meet you guys back when we find out. Alright, guys, here we are. I did have to take out a corrupt Reaper King to get here, but there's our Gaia Snail. And it requires a load of Meteor Berries. Because I'm not going to be using the basic kibble unless I've already got it. So we need to knock this guy out first. Fingers crossed we don't harm him. Ooh, nice. Ooh, we don't have that many meteor berries. Do we have kibble? Hey guys, we can finally get this, the Trank Rifle. So, last night, I set up a base in the Redwoods, right? And the server got shut down about 9 o'clock. So, theoretically, the tree, the tree platform base should have been making sap ever since. So, we should have a lot of sap. We got 23. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to have to wait for more sap. I think it's because we weren't rendering it. But this is a kind of little hidey hole on the tree platform to stop predators from attacking me. 
So if I stay here for a bit, we should have quite a bit of... Quite a bit of sap. Alright guys, we just teleported back to our snail that we originally found. Now, we can tame this guy with Dodo Kibble. And I did wait for him to lose quite a lot of food. I did knock him out to begin with. And I kind of... What did I do? I kind of waited for him to be low on food. Then I wait, awoke him up with a primal stimulant. Uh, well, I just waited for him to wake up. Oh and God. then, because he was already low on food, it was a matter of just giving him the first piece of kibble. So now we're just going to have to wait for him to lose food again. But because we already fed him one time, it should be easier for him to... Well, her... To eat faster because keep in mind on our server it's yeah I'm currently in the middle of my own stuff. What's up? Uh, the clock's not far from base. Okay. Alpha Indom is for Rex female. There's a female Alpha Indom. Not too far from base. Okay, it's ready to eat again because the spyglass will tell you when it's ready to eat. Hey guys, we found a male. Here we go. How much would it take? Four basic kibble. Oh, this is too easy. I'm going to put the awesome teleporter down in case. Yeah. Dodo kibble. We have some back at the base as well. I think it lied. I think it only requires three. I think it doesn't require four at all. I'm going to go on a limb here and say we're fine. I'll meet you guys back when it's ready. Oh, wow. It's ready to eat. There we go. This snail's hungry. Wow. All right. Yeah, definitely only requires one more kibble. I don't know why the spyglass said it required four basic. It only requires three. Unless it's going to glitch out and like give me a very small amount of time, but I I doubt that. I really doubt that. You know, if it's eating this fast, do we really need to wait? You know, do we really need to do a whole new cutscene when, let's face it, half of this video is going to be cutscenes anyway? Because we're building a castle. But hey, a Gaia Snail, that's going to increase our production rate drastically. So, this requires cementing base, right? Hey! Ah, oh, we can breed snails now. This is insane. Wow, that was lucky. Oh, man. We could have lost our snail. That's insane. What's up, Hyper? Alright, guys. After being unconscious underwater, I reckon we should get back to base and breed these snails. So <laughs> I'll see you guys back at base. Hyper the hill. Yeah. Hyper just found a boss Dodo Rex from the pro mine, so we need to build this castle ASAP. I need to hitch the male. Uh, these will start breeding because they're male and female, but you know, it means as we're breeding anyway, let's enable one drink to get their fermenting pace. Uh, we'll increase the weight. Yeah. Why the hell not? It's not like we're going to be using them for levels anyway. Oh, wow, we got organic polymer already. That's insane. And we got 13 cementing paste just from one snail. Oh, this is insane. So is she actually breeding now? Yeah, she's actually breeding. And then we're going to have a baby snail. I want to have all females, to be honest. I want to have a row of females. You know, maybe we'll have a row of hitching posts. And that way we have unlimited dire snails. And then we've got unlimited cementing paste for building the castle. And that, that's a whole unlimited resource. Then we've got our Alpha Dodex and Ankleos to get the metal and stone. We'll be able to build a castle like that, guys. So I'll see you guys when we're building it. Alright, guys. We're back at the tree base. And... Ta-da! We got the full 20 sap this time. So, fingers crossed... When we go back to base, we shall be able to build the gun. If not, then we'll have to, we'll have to make it. <clears throat> but, you know, we've got faith in us. So let's head back to base. 
and fingers crossed we can build this thing because I really want to build it, you know, I don't want to have to wait. Let's go ahead and put the rest of the sap in here and then take a look at this. The fabricator, we can only make the journey one. The fabricated rifle, ooh, we need six pieces of sap, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go back to the tree base and we'll see if we can get that. <laughs> I'm literally just going to wait for six people. What the hell? No! Yeah, I messed up. You got killed by an apex terror bird. Yeah, I didn't even see him. Did you die though? I didn't die? even see him around the area. Guys, that's insane. <laughs> First of all, we teleported into the sky for some weird reason. And then a the hyper got killed by an alpha that, terror bird. Well, Apex. I'm gonna try to stop doing that. You got one piece already. I'm just gonna hide in here from everything. And, uh, I'll meet you guys back. Hyper, did you lose your dino? I think so. Oh man, that's sad. I'm so we got a couple of backup alpha tyranodons that you can use. You're very lucky I am, Dava. Man, that's insane. It's annoying. I need to stop doing this until I got a better dino. You do. All right, we'll see you guys back when we got the six uh, sap. Come on, oh great giant tree. I just need one more piece of sap. I'm begging you. Please, just give me one piece of sap. Guys, we've been waiting here for so long. It's another day. This is so annoying. I just want one piece of sap. I already have the five. We just need six. Yes! Let's go make this gun. Let's go make this trant gun. Finally. Finally. I have no idea how long that took. It really did take the pee, I swear to God. Well, Let's go ahead and make the gun. You. Huh? Have you got a tame helper? I've got a tame helper, what are you trying to tame? The unicorn. You're taming a... a unicorn? It's a bullet. Where? Well, Take me to it? Yeah. That ain't no unicorn, that's a pegasus. Oh well, yeah. Wow. <laughs> I knocked it with my new, uh, pike. That I, uh, upgraded. Damn. Well, it's eaten very slowly. <laughs> Good luck with that. All right, let's make the fabricated sniper primal rifle thingy majiggy. I'd love to tell the whole name of it. All right, come on, guys, we got this. Fabricated rifle majiggy. The thing is, we we only need like no, it's five thousand of each. Yeah, so we just need six pieces of sap, and then we can get this bearing. In. It's better than the normal variant, so yeah. We get the apprentice one because that's all we can afford right now. But we, maybe we can upgrade this one later down the line. Absolutely amazing. If we got a godliest one later down the line, that would be insanity. So we finally have a trank rifle from the primal fear mod. Oh my god, this thing is insanity. We can finally use all of the bullets. That we've been collecting 21 toxic trank bullets and then there's potent trank bullets. Ooh. Nine times more powerful than the trank dart. 18 times more powerful than the trank dart. Ooh. I wonder what we could get with this. Could we finally tame that electric Archeop thing? I wonder exactly how much the toxic trank bullets do, you know? I'd love to check that out. That'd be insane. I know I did see one over by the other area. I know we're supposed to be doing our castle, but Hyper, would you mind if I went and checked it out to try and to try and knock it out, see if that's a thing? I can't find my oh uh, right here. I lost my alpha. I forgot. I lost my alpha Tyrannodon. I can't actually go over there. Oh, that's irritating. Hey guys, take a look at this. We are we are actually making primal infused nux primal infused toxic narcotics because of that primal shark we managed to salvage from the beach that was dead. This is insanity right here. All that blood can be put towards I mean it's 45 times more potent than a vanilla dart. How insane is that? All we need to do now is find out how to make the bullets. 
So to make the bullet, we want the, the primal infused one, right? Primal infused trank bullet. So we'd need primal rifle bullets. How do we get that? Hey guys, Hyper's currently trying to attack a mantis. He's uh, having a bit of trouble. But we did manage to get this gun a bit earlier. Now I've been focusing on the bullets and with the uh, with the primal blood, so we came across a dead primal megalodon on the beach. And I've been using some of its blood and uh, hide to make the primal narcotic. And we were able to make this, the primal infused toxic tranquil. They do 10,000 torpor per hit. So this is absolutely insanity. So yeah, we could definitely tame an Indarm or something with this. But what I'm focusing on now is getting the electric elemental Archaeops. I know they're not called Archaeopses, but like, I might as well call it that. So see this guy? He can one-shot anything. So yeah, absolutely insane. But we're not going to get this guy. I just wanted to show you how powerful the bullets are. So, yeah, I'll see you guys back when we get the elemental Archaeops and we're ready to tame it. Alright, see you guys back in a bit. Alright guys, so, I've been focusing on some more armor. I've built the helmet and the chest piece. I'm just going to build the leggings as well. Because I want I want better armor because we keep dying constantly. And, like, it keeps getting annoying. So... So far, we've got up to 4,000 armor. I do want to get better gauntlets as well. Now, I do have these insane gauntlet blueprints. I'll show you guys now. Uh, where are they? Gauntlets. Alright, so, scroll up. Here we go. 2,000 armor's worth. But I need more Apex Hide in order to get it. It's really irritating. But I, I definitely think we can do that. And then if we can get some boots. I know we have some insane boot blueprints. 2,000 right here as well. But that also requires Apex Hide. But if we can get that, we'd have pretty much the best armor set in the game. I mean, look at this. Each piece of this has 1,000 armor on. At least. 1,000 almost 2,000, almost 2,000, that's insane. So yeah, we can definitely increase our armor. Definitely. All right, guys, we found our first Alpha Dodecarus. We can replace the female that got killed. It's got 50,000 Torpor, so five bullets should actually do this. One. Come on, we got this. Two, three. Four. Wow, four bullets. That's insane. I love this gun so much. Let's go with the Alpha Kibble now and use this. One, two, three, four, five. Sorted. Hey, hey. We finally got our Alpha Dodec back. It just, it's really annoying that it got destroyed. It really is. All right. Finally got our Alpha Dodec back. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in a DS Soul Transfer Orb. And then we've only got the Electric Archaeops to get. And then fingers crossed we can prepare for the castle for tomorrow's episode. Alright guys, we are back at the base. I've been kind of building this Alpha, this mix between Apex and Alpha armor. All we need now is the boots. I've just come back from using the Alpha and Cleosaurus for metal and then we've been just been using that to get the best armor we can. So if there's any boots we can get, that'd be insane. This one here looks cool. 730. Yeah, we're going to need about 300 more metal. Alright, well, after that we can go ahead and get the electric Archaeops that we said we were going to get and call it an episode. Alright guys, we finally have enough for the boots. 730 metal, that is insanity. And that's 2,625 armor just on the boots alone. Wow. So we've got a mixture of Apex. That's Apex, that's 
alpha, that's alpha, that's apex, that's apex. So if we replace these with better apex blueprints, apparently we're supposed to get some sort of buff. So if we can replace these two, we can get some sort of buff. That would be insane. I wonder what it is. Do we have any... Do you have any Apex chest plates or anything? We should do, right? Apex leggings here. Apex chest plate here. Let's just get these and see exactly what they do. Because I'm interested to see this buff. Obviously, I'm not going to wear them because the armor wouldn't be that good. But fingers crossed. Who knows exactly what it will be? So we're supposed to get some sort of buff, right? Some sort of armor buff? Huh. I guess he doesn't have it in this mod. Alpha, alpha, no, that's apex, 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 apex. Yeah, so... That's insane! We don't, we don't actually get a buff. Why don't we get a buff? Oh, okay, then I thought I thought maybe we got some sort of a buff. It must be the other armor that doesn't give you a buff. Well, these two were cheap anyway, so we don't need them. And we know that the apex armor doesn't give you a buff now, so that's that means we don't need to get it. So, all right, guys, I found a elemental feather light I want to tame. So fingers crossed we can put a starting base over it. <laughs> we got it. Alright, all we need now is to knock it out with these. Thing is though, it's so overpowered. So we might need to use bullets. I don't know if it can be bowled first, so let's try that. That is a negatory. It cannot be bowled. But it can be angered. Wow. That thing might want to get out. Is it still angry at us? Oh, it should be alright. I say we leave. I let it stop being angry. And head back when it's calm. Yeah, it's really trying to get out. I reckon we. our only hope is to try and knock this thing out. Yep. All right. I think we got this, guys. AD. Oh, did we really miss that? We can't afford to miss that. We got to make sure every shot lasts, guys. We got this. Yep. Come on. It's going to start running. These bullets are incredible. Oh, reloading. Look at me saying reloading. It's like I'm playing a Call of Duty match. Hey, come on. Hey, we got it. A fire feather light. This thing's going to be insane. Hyper, I bet you're excited, aren't you? You can get one too, because there's a male on the server. Only one, though, so if it dies, we will be absolutely screwed. All right, come on. Elemental kibble. One, two, three, four. Wait, is it really that hungry? Do we need a taming helper? Ah, can't hurt. Two, three, four. And do we need it without a saddle or do we need a saddle? Oh no, we can ride it without a saddle. That's insane, guys. Oh, that is absolutely insane. I say we pick up the starter house and go for the mail. Let's check this thing out. So, it has a flamethrower attack. My guess is that's right click. Yeah, and it normal attacks just a normal feather light. So this thing's very fast as well. If we breed these, we can have unlimited flyers. So what damage are we talking to boot? 5,000 to boot. That's insane. Wow, 3,000 flamethrower attack. Flamethrower. Oh, and it hits from a long way away. This would be insane. What about from here? 
No? Here? Here? Yeah, so quite a... Oh, and it harvests as well. Oh, that is insane. We just killed a dreadful... Candy? Whatever it's called. Oh, that is insanity. I'm loving him so much. He's so overpowered. Oh, yeah. we got to get the mail. We have to get the mail. We have to make these breedable. Now, I've learned my... I've learned my lesson from last time, guys. We're going to put this guy in the breeding pen where he's nice and safe. And leave him alone <laughs> until we've got the mail. So, fingers crossed. Honestly, I wanted an archer. But after seeing these, I'm like, yes, defo. So did someone die, unfortunately? I see a death bag. Alpha Dodo. Oh, right, yeah, I left that there. It's fine. <gasps> I left them breeding and I forgot about them. Oh, my God, I just saw a baby. Behavior. Disable mating. Behavior. Disable mating. So where's the baby? <gasps> there he is. Oh, he's adorable. We got a baby alpha. Oh, he's very low in health, though. But he's just been given food just before he died. Do we have any other babies? No, just a one? But she's pregnant again. That's insanity. All right, we'll go get the mail. And I'll meet you guys back when we're ready to breed them. I love my fire feather light. He's adorable. All right, guys. I know these last couple of episodes have been a bit weird with the audio. But... Episode 6 will be fixed because Hype will be at his PC when we do the castle. So, first of all, take a look over here. Does the male feather light? Right? Around here somewhere, anyway. At least it says it's around here. Is it underground? How's it got underground? Is there a cave somewhere nearby? That's insanity. It is legit apparently in a cave. Ooh, we need to put a teleporter here. Huh? Looks like building isn't allowed in caves. Can we put it outside the cave? Ha! Loophole! I'm going to call it Crystal Cave. Might as well, right? That is insanity. So we got unlimited crystal from here too. And the feather light's just down there. We just need to find a way to it. I'm getting that feather light, guys. Uh, I know there's a way through here. There has to be, right? I want my feather light, guys. Hey, guys. I found the main cave. Found the main cave. So that means our feather light should be somewhere in here. I wonder if this is how you can get to Aberration. That right there is an Apex Seeker. I'm going to need Dino Aid. Let's take out the Seeker then. Hyper just teleported to me. Hyper, you can't kill anything in here. Nah, man. Alpha Seeker. I killed an Apex. You're going to be easy straight. You saw me kill the Apex. Why would you even... Did you seriously just... All right, guys, we're in the cave and we have managed to knock it out. Well, we haven't knocked it out yet, but we will do. It's a very dangerous area, though, guys. Nope! Passive! Passive, don't you dare attack that. You know how long we... Oh, no. No, no, no. You're not following me. No. 
<laughs> bad Pteranodon. Guys, that would have been bad. All right, let's just bring our Pteranodon in here as close as we can. And now we'll be able to... How much did it say? Two elemental kibble, right? And these can make our breedable pairs. Oh, wow, he's very hungry. Nice, we got him. Oh, that is insanity right there. Absolutely insane. All right, I'll meet you guys back at the base. And we can finally start breeding these two. And then I say we call it an episode. What do you say, Hyper? Yeah. All right, guys, we're finally back here at the base. At the breeding center that Hyper built us. Perfect. Oh, wow. Want to go on a walk? I reckon we can do that. I do need to move it out of the way anyway. Set this to manual temporarily. So it doesn't shut when he tries to walk through. Come on, little dude. Get the imprint you need. Come on. Hey! There we go. Alright, guys. Everything is now sorted. So we've got the mothers and the fathers and the babies over here. Enichionis did attack the base and they did have to sort everything out in the breeding center. But we it was worth it. We got our amazing elemental feather lights. This is absolutely insane. A fire feather light. How cool is this? I just want to park them perfectly, but they won't. And they do they do actually produce elemental eggs, I just saw one. I didn't know if it was just the archers that did that, so I was actually concerned, but no, it turns out it is it is these guys. That's insane. I just want to park him properly. This is crazy. Because they, they can't move backwards. And I'm kind of, I'm kind of like... It's kind of like an OCD thing. I don't have OCD. But it's like it's, it's like that. And they just need to be parked perfectly. Okay, come on, come on. Let me go over here. Yes, okay. If I can fly on you, then you can kick me off. Okay, well... Okay, is that a thing? No. Can you use a grappling hook on the ceiling? Is that a thing? Oh. Okay, somehow I, I accidentally opened my parachute, but it worked. Alright, so let's get these guys bred. Because they're powerfuller than the alphas. And they drop eggs. So they'll be the perfect breeding partner. Hyper's PC just crashed. Wow, that's crazy. Oh, I was near my boy. Well, at least it's the end of the episode. <laughs> Alright, guys. We tried to protect Hyper, but unfortunately, it said he was invisible, and then it said he wasn't invisible, and it was just a mess. I tried to pull his dino back, but this happens. He's riding him, I can't. So, yeah, it's pretty insane, to be honest, but... Yeah, thank you so much for watching the episode. I think, should we call it here? Yeah, I mean, let's face it, guys. We've done a lot this episode. We've got, well, all these dinos. It was kind of like a quick episode where we're just cutting through some of the most crucial moments before we build a castle. I mean, we got Ankylosauruses. We got Dodecaruses. We got Elementals. So this is insane. Elemental tier Featherlight. Both of those are mine, but Hyper can have an egg. So absolutely insane i mean look at these featherlight egg and we have elemental eggs we can finally get the apex tier dinos now so thank you all so much for watching if you enjoyed it don't forget to hit the like button and i'll see you guys in the next episode unreal sent them looking fly in my apex armor peace out